Hi, in this video we're going to show you how you could change or disable Windows sounds. Now you might have noticed um, when you do certain things in Windows you'll get a sound associated with it like if you get an error you'll get a beep or when Windows starts you'll get the startup sound or when it shuts down you'll get the shutdown sound or even something as silly as maximizing or minimizing a program you'll have a sound and that gets annoying after a while so if you want to turn those off that's easy or if you want to kind of customize it with your own sounds you could do that as too so all you need to do is first get to control panel so if you don't know how to get there you go to start control panel or if you have the Windows 10 menu you could just you know do a search for control panel type of thing however you want to get there and then you want to go to sound and that'll pop up this and you want to go to the sounds tab so it's usually set to Windows default and it shows you what sound is set for what and then if you click on test it'll play you a little sample of that sound and let's say there's something that you want to change or it doesn't have a sound like oh I don't like this calendar reminder sound you could that's what the default is and you could browse and and it has some built-in WAV files or if you have your own you, if you want to download something off the internet for something funny you could do that too so you could just pick a different one and apply it to that and you can kind of scroll down the list and you can see there's a lot that don't have sounds and you know if they all had sounds then it would get pretty annoying It'd be beeping all over the place so what you could do too if you want to turn it off which is what I always do because I don't need a sound with every little thing I do you could just click on no sounds and that'll get rid of all the sounds there. I just click on apply and OK. And then every time you know you do something, you're not going to be annoyed by a little sound, you know, coming in. So if you want to set it back, just simply go back to the sounds tab and set it to the default, or you could keep it here and just kind of you know customize your own one, that type of thing, whatever you want to do. All right, so that's about it for that. So thanks for watching.